Welcome back to Ghost Club Paranormal. Tonight we are in Hemet, California and we are investigating the Patterson House. The house was built in 1981 by John Patterson for his wife and their five kids. And inside this house you'll actually notice there's a lot of furnishings and that is the original furnishings from the family. It kind of feels like you're trespassing honestly. It feels like they're going to come home at any moment. Now the spirits of this family have been said to still haunt the property. 120 apparitions have been seen on these grounds. Now Mandy doesn't know anything about this property but she is inside right now and she's getting the vibe for it so let's see if any spirits are coming forward. Now one thing that does kind of strike me as odd is John Patterson. I don't really know what type of guy he was but there was a couple of girls who came in to investigate this house only two weeks ago and one of the girls reported getting pushed downstairs. They said that there was an angry man spirit here and I just don't know if this is John or not. It's so strange but I know that him and his family are seen here especially his wife but I'm curious to see if Mandy picks up on that energy. Okay, so you have been in here for like 30 minutes, so what have you found? I'm, I'm gonna be honest, I don't really like it in here. So first off, initially, um, there's a very prominent man in this home. Um, he feels very much like I lived in this home, I own this home. He just has a really strong energy, so I'm trying to figure out if he is genuinely that like angry and aggressive or if it's just that he just has a really strong presence so i'm still trying to figure that out mm -hmm. um but what was interesting is this man was so prominent and then he stepped away he's an observer he follows you throughout the home he watches no funny business i wrote no funny business like he's not about it like do okay. not fuck about in this home you know he's very like adamant about that but he stepped away and this woman stepped forward this woman made me feel like she couldn't speak, like she couldn't, um, it was almost like gasping for air, but it wasn't a, in like a strangulation kind of way. It was in a, I, I didn't have a voice. I didn't have a say. I couldn't say anything. I had to, I had to be a certain way. And then it was like, he's coming. I have to go. Mm -hmm. And then she quickly ran out. Oh, that's weird. So, um, which startled me cause I wasn't expecting her energy like that. Yeah. Um, and that's where she was the one that said perfect on the outside, but not on the inside. This woman said, I have to go. And I was like, oh boy. And then there was a noise, what sounded like on the staircase. So oh, as if like somebody upstairs. like was like leaving. Mm -hmm. Weird. So that was kind of cool. I just want to throw that out there. So I have a quick So they're not coming out. in as a family unit no. kind of thing. Okay, that's weird. Okay. All right. No. What else okay. did you write down there? Um, sorry, it's all scribble. Um, Oh, heart and chest pain. I don't know if somebody passed from like a heart attack or something like that here, but something, something going on in here, which feels related to the man. Was there a death on this property? There were two deaths on this okay. property. Yeah. Okay. Um, cause I'm definitely, I'm definitely picking up on like, I'm picking up on like a natural death. And then I'm also picking up on another death. That... Okay. So that's interesting. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm just going to believe. I don't know what this is, but it's like mm, questionable. Maybe. Yeah. Okay. The man is definitely extremely prominent in this home. Like his energy, you could feel it from a mile away. So I really want to tap into him a little bit more. Yeah. He doesn't want that, but. That's that so say That was my flashlight. Right like. Just getting set up here, but. That just said, take baby ahead. Wait, what? That just said, take baby ahead. So I don't know where, let me put my spirit talker on. Real okay, fast. yeah, sorry, we're okay, so. Literally, <laughs> right as we're setting up, okay. This house doesn't actually have any electricity or running water. Can you stay a while? Yeah, we absolutely can stay a while. Um, can I ask who we're talking with right now? Who's asking us to stay a while? I just heard movement over here, like, like as if something was, somebody was going through something. If you're here with us, can you just show that you're here with us by touching one of the devices? We have one here. If you're hesitant to come into this room right now, we also have another device over there. 
by the piano. I don't know if it's because they don't want us here and they don't want people really investigating this home, but it feels intentional. Like the chaos, like our day, like getting here was chaotic. Yeah. And all of that felt intentional. Just to add on that, what Mandy was saying about our day being absolutely chaotic. I mean, we got here like five hours after we should have originally got here. There was just so much stuff, so many accidents on the freeway. We get here and it was like none of the cameras were working. We were actually going to set up like static cams in all of the rooms and honestly like half of the cameras stopped working. I was like, let's just not do that. But um, yeah, is that intentional? Did somebody in this home intentionally do that so we would spend less time here? Now, are you trying to get us out of this room? My name. What is it? How about this? How about we start off by telling you our names? So my name is Jade. I'm Mandy. And we come here in complete peace, by the way. We do not mean to cause any chaos in this household. We respect your home. We want to know your story. We want to get to know your family and there's a priest. There's a priest? Mm -hmm. I know that you guys are religious. I know that because this picture over here, the Lord is my shepherd. I feel like I'm not welcomed here and I feel like I'm not liked. And it's been a while since I've walked into a building and felt that way. So you're not into spiritualism? Communicating with the other side is not something that's like... Um... If you don't want us here, can you please go ahead and light up a device for us? Just one device, if you want us to leave. The family that lived here, uh, the Pattersons, they, they- Republican marriage. Republican marriage? <laughs> that is so specific. That's conservative, right? Like that's like, yeah. that's a very conservative traditional way of things right at least that's how i'm taking it mm -hmm. especially if we're thinking like a little bit of times like further back um <gasps> yep oh wow and now. you're standing completely still <laughs> thank you did you huh no debunked <gasps> Thank you so much. That was weird. Did you hear that? That was that your was that your stomach? Seriously? No, I. That's what I thought I heard, but I think it's the dog outside. That was your stomach. No, that's what, dude. That is what I heard. That is that's what okay. I heard from you. It sounds like a no. stomach. Girl, I went to the bathroom. I'm good. <laughs> no, seriously, that was like two growls. Wait a minute. That's a baby high chair. Oh. This said take baby ahead. Oh my gosh. That's a baby high chair. Okay, well. Okay, hold on. Okay. Real fast. I'm just gonna go and. Oh, I'm so cold right now, too. Can you tell? Fail. Huh? Fail. Fail. Take baby ahead. Fail. Oh my gosh. Uh oh. So I know the story here, but Mandy doesn't. So if you could let Mandy in on that, please. Can you give her some information? Because I know what you're, you're saying. It's weird. Um, again, we've talked about this before. I don't believe in babies being stuck here. That's yeah. not how that works, um, in, in my opinion and what I've been doing. But for some reason, there is. it seems like there is this energy, and I, it, maybe it's residual at this point, but this energy of like, please like help my baby to the light. But the baby's already in the light. I don't know if, if something happened to her mentally towards the end of her life, but there's this like confusion. And I don't know if it's that confusion still kind of present. Like my baby needs to like go into eternity. Like my baby needs to go to the light. Like, please take my baby ahead, like help cross the baby over. Yeah. But the baby's already over. So it's this weird like energy. I don't like that. That's sad. That's sad. 
See, that was a whistle or something. Did you hear that? Yeah. That makes sense. The whistling. Okay. We'll have to talk about that after. Busy. Oh my gosh, the ball just went Did you hear that? Yeah, that was upstairs. Okay. So this was the youngest child in the family and his name was Lloyd and Lloyd passed there's away. There's more of us. There's more of us. There are, there are more children. Yeah. Um, I haven't told you how many, but yeah, yeah he, he was definitely the youngest. <laughs> Somebody keeps on lighting up this ball. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Jade? I don't have... That's wild. Wait, it just said Jade and then it said the hat. That's what it sounded like. Jade and the hat? Did it just say high chair? It just said high chair. Babe, it, that sounded like it said baby. That cat bell is not going off. It's constant. It's not turned off since I've put that down there. Can you please go up to the device that's in front of the little bunny there and can you make that one light up? Oh. I've been here a hundred years. And the cat ball's lighting up. I think we'll go back to using this device in a little bit, but I just really want to point out that this is... Oh, and it stopped. I was just about to say, this is very unusual for a cat ball to be going off non-stop. Yeah. Usually it stops for a little bit, but that's, that was non-stop for a good couple minutes. It was non-stop for a while. That was upstairs. There was like footsteps. Can you come down here with us? There's somebody up there. You said that you've been here for a hundred years, and that's that's true. You have been here. This house was built in 1891. I was saying this outside, but it does feel like we're kind of trespassing, like we've broke into somebody's home because it feels like they're about to come back at any minute. Yeah, it's still very much their home. Your hair. <gasps> you touching your hair. What? <laughs> The spirit that's been coming through since we've been in here, I would say it's feminine if you agree with that. Is it saying something on there? It said build. It was built in 1891, actually over a hundred years ago. Are you happy that it's being preserved? You know, we helped, uh, we actually paid to be here tonight <laughs> um, to actually help. Where, where? You're aware of me, yes, yes. It's very apparent that we're talking to um, the lady of the house. This is you, actually. <laughs> I love that they have pictures of the family, the, the real family in this home. Yeah. Even though you're not into the paranormal. Abandoned. It, yes, the house was abandoned. That's wild, Mandy. The house was abandoned for a very long time. Winchester Historical Society came in and they decided to, to keep this home because they knew how much it meant to you. But basically, even though you're not into the paranormal investigating, that's kind of one of the ways to preserve this house. Please do not look at it as a negative thing. Um, we're, we're very, very respectful. And we just want to come here and have a conversation with you and you're doing so well, so thank you. You don't just have to respond through the device that's sitting on top of the iron board. You can actually respond through the other devices that we have on the table here. Mirror. Mirror. I fucking knew it. That was Stairs. so... <gasps> what I would actually like to do is go up there and use the digital recorder and hold it up to the mirrors and okay. see if we get any responses. Okay. Okay. That works. <gasps> that's a big one. Holy moly! Oh, I just feel gross. I'm sorry, I scared myself. 
Oh, I didn't even realize that there were spiders that big here. That's how many, that's what they were in the bathroom. Oh. That's why I was like, we can't use that bathroom, Jade. So you're thinking it was in this mirror? This yeah. is the mirror that they want us to go to? It's the only mirror so far that's really been like, yeah. The bell. The bell. Funny, same room pod that we had downstairs in the dining room. Same battery. Something about this area. It's just like not it. It's like a siren. Watch me, because I'm just gonna do this like no cuts. Fucking, I knew that was gonna happen. Yeah, dude, something's happening over there. Well, uh, add that mirror to the list. Again, this place does not have any electricity. Okay, I'm just gonna try one thing. I'm just gonna try, <laughs> before we get this started up yeah, yeah, here, yeah, yeah, yeah. I wanna try and move that exact REM pod back to that spot right there. Okay. freaking hot in here, but that was, that's amazing. Wow. Okay, okay. All right, if that is you, can you please step away from that device? If you're able to, so it stops making that noise. Are you in the hallway? Well, no, there's somebody definitely in this room with us. Um, yeah, I don't know what's going on with this. Oh, that's not ominous at all. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we're about to open this up. There's gonna be some treasure map inside. Is it this? Oh, it would have been like a photo album. Yeah, there's no photos in there. I'm getting like weird. The energy just got me fucking weird. They just showed me like going through this vent. Oh, do you think something's like hiding in the vent? Yeah. I know I am dead. I know I am dead. Holy shit, I feel like I'm, I might actually pass out on this investigation. I don't think I've ever been this hot on an investigation. I want to tell you to take off your hat. But what if a spider gets inside it? Because um, that's a very real possibility. Well, um, and then maybe find something to fan yourself in the meantime. <gasps> says thank you. <gasps> thank you. Is that because I took my hat off? Jade, Jade earlier, remember it's saying the, the hat. You were being respectful. I wasn't being respectful. But look at me now. <laughs> I can't, I can't film like this. Oh this my is madness. God. Is that what you wanted me to do was to take my hat off? I am so sorry. I did say that we're very respectful. We are, but I didn't even think about that. Yeah. I swear it said Jade, like the hat. Wait, and before that it said, I know I'm dead. And on my hat it says, not dead yet. Oh. Yo. Whoa. Dang. <laughs> They're so, like, they're so present that they're reading. That's crazy. That's actually crazy. That's wild. Okay. Alrighty. I don't know if that came from outside, but that sounded like a little girl or yeah, baby or yeah, something. I, it, yeah, I heard the same thing. Well, good thing we're about to do a digital recorder session. Mm. 
Start with this one. This one's okay. freaking, this something's going on. Okay. Uh, huh. Oh, I just got like a stabbing. Oh. Just as I was like starting to approach the, over here. Hmm. That hurt. This is going to sound really weird, but like, instead of us asking questions, can you just put the digital recorder up to the mirror and say, speak to me? I don't know why, like I just, do you want me to say it? Like speak to me? If you want to. I don't know why, I keep like feeling like that's the words that have to be said. Okay, recording. Speak to me. Again. That was wild. Did you hear that? Yes. Maybe she doesn't want us to hear whatever's on it. If there is anything That's, on it. Yeah. <gasps> what are the odds of that? I don't know where that spider went either. Okay, that was interesting. All right. Okay, well, I'm very intrigued. Right. What? It doesn't want us to listen to whatever is on that. If anything, which I'm starting to feel like there is, it doesn't want us to hear it. And it's almost like, oh, you know what they just showed me? Oh, I just got full body chills. I got chills too. I just got chills. You know what they just showed me? What? They just showed me that I I don't think there's going to be anything on here, but, but listening to it in its entirety is going to open this up fully. Ooh, and I, I, I think like they don't that. want that. Yeah. But we still have to listen I know. to it. <laughs> is this the same spirit do you think that was coming on? Like, church. Church! Dude, I'm a priest, church, all that stuff. Sorry. Is she saying that we need to go to church because we're doing this? Or so there's two women. Oh, there's okay. like there's two women. Okay. There's one, and I you'll see it on my notebook. I wrote uh -huh. it down. There's one who's like mom, like the wife, the yeah. mom, and then there's this other woman who's like I wrote. She's a stickler. Like she's like judgy as fuck. All cool. right, here we Ooh. go. Okay. Actually can't breathe. That was very, very loud. Thank you. To whoever made that noise. They're straight up. I don't. I don't think the cameras are going to pick up on that. But it sounds like somebody's just in the dining room. At least we have the video recording down there. But it was like you're not listening to the bell. So here I'm yeah. gonna fucking start throwing things around. Yeah. All right, let's listen back. Let's listen to this. Okay, let me. Let's listen to this. Okay, let me. I'm gonna just. I'm gonna start it over for a sec. I need to. I need to go downstairs, man. I really, really am Wait. about to pass out in okay. here. All right, let's leave. Let's leave that camera rolling right there. Whilst we go downstairs and take a breather because, man, it is hot. Dude, did you just do the same thing? 
So, oh, you looked up there too? Yeah. I yeah. shit you not. Know, I just thought I saw. That is so freaking right. weird. I thought I, I saw a face up there. Okay, yeah. Oh, <laughs> no, I, something was telling me to look up. They're like, you leaving yet? <laughs> I know. They're like watching from up there. I live in the dark. My camera light just freaking turned off the second like we were about to come back in. Okay. in the corner there. It's like something get ya. Yeah. That was a tap. Yes. Where? Hold on. We have been hearing knocks and bangs coming from through here for a while. Can you do it again? I want to hear your loudest bang. Yeah, you heard the whistle, right? Yeah. I don't know where it's coming from though. It sounds like it's it's all over. It's, it's weird. all over, which is why I was hearing it literally all over. Interesting. The okay. last two days, that's insane, dude. So bizarre. Which I haven't even told anybody about the whistling. So you know how I tell you, two days prior to every investigation, spirit comes to me. Mm -hmm. I have been hearing whistling and it's a man whistling. And so, to hear the whistle in here, I'm mm -hmm. like, that makes sense. Some, somebody said that you shouldn't whistle at night. <laughs> I don't yeah. know why, Shit. but. <laughs> Recording. Speak to me. Okay, stop it. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> Sorry, I'm mad that massive wolf spider is on the move. It was right there and it was crawling right for you, Mandy. <laughs> Stop. It's so weird to God. <laughs> Let's listen to that. Um, in the hallway? Hi. Or in another room? Somewhere? This looks safe. <sighs> okay. Do you know what it it's says? It's a female voice. And it's, it's like... Don't say it. Okay. I want to hear it. Okay. There's, there's something there. I, I honestly, I feel like it's saying, speak to me. That a thousand percent says, speak to me. But it sounds like it's shouting. It sounds like it's from a distance. Grandfather. Hmm. Now, I didn't really know of a grandfather in this house, but I mean, obviously a grandfather has ah, to I feel like I'm gonna fall down these stairs. Dude. I feel like, like, I feel like I'm gonna fall down those stairs. Okay, that is freaking weird because that's exactly what happened two weeks ago to two. That's exactly what happened two weeks ago to two. There was movement in there. I'm so sorry. Sorry, there was there was something moving in there. Oh no, I believe you. I heard it. I definitely heard something, but we can't go into that room because that's okay. the caretaker's room. Okay, okay. Um, basically, two okay. girls were here a couple of weeks ago and they didn't have a good experience here at all. I think one of the girls fell down the stairs and then she actually said that it felt like somebody pushed her down the stairs. So. Yeah, that's interesting. Mm -hmm. It's very like... I mean, I've walked up and down these a couple of times with my flashlight like this, but yeah. that was the first time where I genuinely felt like I was, like, I felt like I was going to get pushed. That's interesting. Jeez. Okay. <gasps> nice. Oh, so cute! <laughs> this place is crazy.
crazy. Oh, cockroach. Set your camera up on the piano. We're gonna have some fun with the gold heels and ghosts. Sing it, girl. That was beautiful. Thanks. Brighter? Brighter. Brighter. <laughs> Where did that voice come from? Uh, brighter? Brighter. Brighter. <laughs> Where did that voice come from? Brighter? Brighter. Mandy's gonna go into S's right now, um, but before we start, look above you. Oh. See that vent? Yeah. That is the exact vent that's in the room oh. upstairs. And remember you were saying, like, I feel something to do with that vent? Yeah. Yeah. There it is. That makes sense. Mm-hmm. And this is where you felt drawn the entire time you've been in this house. I feel like you you keep wanting to go back to this specific spot. Mm -hmm. It's weird that some something or somebody is traveling through that vent. Yeah. I don't, I don't like that. Any spirits who want to come forward, please, please do. We have devices set up around the room for you to interact with, to show us that you're here and you're willing to talk with us. This is a new piece of equipment we have here. This is the music box, and this was actually created by Spotted Ghost from the UK. He is also the creator of the Spirit Talker app. So, and you know we love that thing. I feel like I need to hold something of the families. That's weird. That was a very specific request. Um, I actually feel like I'm gonna hold that. I don't know why, I've never been asked to like hold anything before, but I'm just gonna just keep it on my lap. Maybe somebody just wants to protect me. I don't know, but I'm just gonna keep that. <laughs> She's thing. like, you're gonna need Jesus. <laughs> For fucking real. Unless, I mean, listen, there's always, there's always something around, right? And I feel like there is something around. It's nothing like some of the other locations that we've been to, but it's definitely has a presence here. Mm -hmm. It's just less pronounced. So, you know, just in case. Yeah. I'll see you on the other side. Spirits, I am fully open for communication. You can use my body, you can speak through me, whatever you need to do to get your messages through. Okay. Tall person, tall, tall, female voice, demonic, coming, tall, I hate her. I want to know who is the most prominent spirit here? Is it this man who doesn't like women? I'm coming. The same one who tried to push a girl downstairs or did push a girl downstairs a couple of weeks ago? Hello? Do I have you here with me right now? You. Okay. Why are you aggressive? Leave me alone. Why are you aggressive towards women? And know that you don't like talking about it and I've been Mandy. specifically asked by the caretaker you. not to really talk about it, but I do want to know. Is that how you treated your daughters? Oh, that was the deepest voice I've ever heard. No, I'm being genuinely serious. I want to know if if that's how you treated your daughters. Why are why is he the He takes it. Dude, I heard that. Oh! <laughs> Come through the That headphones. voice. It said it was saying a prayer. It was like father me. It was like so loud. Oh my god. Okay, well Shade. Hello. Do you have a message for me? Beautiful. Beautiful? That's very kind of you. Is this John? John Patterson? Or is this Maria Patterson? Or is this one of the children? That was him. That Leave was, him alone. That was him. 
Go study your work. So, John Patterson, you're the one that just... Mean dad. Mean dad. My back is... Wait for it. Keep standing. Ooh. Inviting. John. John. Uh, John, yes. If you're here... I'm back. I need proof that you are here, John. Wait, hold on. I've just fucking realized something. Mandy doesn't know. Take. Mandy's been saying John. She doesn't know that the... His teeth? That it, his name is John. His teeth. I Go to the chapel. I don't know. I'm getting this like weird feeling that like John was like a, a good dad, but he also had this kind of like alter ego almost. Seven. Seven alter egos? What does that mean? What? God bless the cross. John. John, come into this room right Whoa, now. Oh, that was like gunshot. It was like bop, bop, bop. That voice just yelled at me and it was like, some of you need, and then it just stopped. I feel like every time that I challenge John, he gets very like, like, don't do it. Don't go there. It's weird. Get the mom. Get the mom? Welcome. Don't. She's telling me not to provoke You're him. You're bold. Oh. <laughs> I live here, the mother. Maria Patterson, if you're here with us, the mom, can you please come into this room? We have been communicating I with you. I need a nurse. You need a nurse? Why? Is the man- The baby. Oh, for your baby. For your baby? You need a nurse? I was thinking maybe she, she needed a nurse herself. Mandy's went very quiet. Um, Maria, is that what you're asking? A, a nurse for your, 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 your child? Maybe two years. Is that how old your baby was right here? Lloyd? Whoa. You see him? Yes, I do. Oh my gosh. Hold on. Yeah, uh-huh. He was kind of sick. Yes, he was. I am so sorry that you had to lose your son the way you did at so young as well. That's genuinely very, very heartbreaking. The son wanted... I just heard a fucking whistle. Him. Parent. Oh my God, dude. This voice is yelling at me and it's so clear. Dad. Are, is people coming in here and asking questions and and doing this kind of stuff? Is is because I want to say that the spirits like Let me they, out. they live their lives just like how we live no. our lives, I, and I really truly wonder if maybe they're they're arguing about this whole situation. Paranormal investigators coming in here like this is a newer the thing. The pressure I'm under. The pressure you're under because you. I need money. Because you're speaking, oh my god. So she is talking to the paranormal investigators to keep people coming in to help restore this house. Is John upset that that you're- Yes. Oh my god. I am so sorry, Maria. Design this. Yes. This was your house, you- she's- oh my gosh, she is so- Can you say that again? She is so house proud. You are so house proud, Maria. That's amazing. And I'm so sorry if this is causing um, tension between you and your husband right now. I am absolutely mind blown by this entire thing. I, and I just seriously, I want to... I pleaded. He died. You're not listening. Are you still... The boy. Okay, I was about to say, are you still talking... To, are you talking about your baby or are you talking about your husband? She keeps on bringing back this baby. It's... Her life was this little boy. You're not. Okay, let me ask you this, okay? What, the future of our family. What do you. Gone. Mm -hmm, okay. What do you need? 
me to do, if I can help you in any sort of way, how can I do that? How can we do that? Do you see? What are you trying to show me? I am so sorry. I don't understand. <gasps> wow, okay, okay. That was like the first tap that we've heard in this room. The chair. What chair? The chair. The they stay. Yeah, the chairs, they stayed. They're, they're your chairs. Run. The authority. Am I right in saying that this is John coming back in? Does it get too rowdy in here for you, John? It's the enemy. Honor me. What is this? Okay, John, you're here, right? I don't know what you think we're here for. Like, we're not trying to like- Stop. Summon the devil or anything like that here. Authority. Respect. There is a lot of respect coming from our end. The rabbit, the chair. The rabbit on the chair. Dude, the rabbit on the chair. Careful. Radio. I'm gonna sneak. She didn't notice me moving. So look at this rabbit on the high chair. You're back. I'm back. Thank yes. you. Oh my gosh. Remember that's where the cat ball was going off like crazy earlier. Is that where you wanted it? Yes. Oh my gosh. That's better. Stop. I'm protecting. Prote From death. Protecting who? From death. I failed. Oh, you're talking about your baby again? This is where she likes to talk. I mean. I failed as a mom. Oh my gosh, my heart is absolutely breaking right now. It was tough. No, you didn't fail as a mom at all. Please don't say that. I, again, I don't know what happened. Just know that your love for that child like shows. Even in the afterlife, which is absolutely, it's just, it's amazing. And you didn't fail as a mom. You as a wife. I'm like honestly about to cry. This is crazy. John's saying that she failed as a wife. I am so sorry. Oh my God. Wait, I... Every time I try and walk into this room, I can stay here for a little bit. What do you want to say? Go up. Go up. Through. Through. She does not know that I'm in here, guys. When you want to. Who's telling me to go up? This is my house. Who's telling me to go through the house and up the stairs? Yes. John, are you telling me to go upstairs or is Maria telling me to go upstairs? <gasps> what the fuck? Sorry, sorry, sorry. It almost sounded like one of the chairs just moved through there, Mandy. Like I was standing next to the chair and it sounded like the chair, like a chair moved. Oh, dude, that, okay, there's, uh, I didn't want to get you out, like, because the conversation is so freaking intelligent, Mandy, that it's like, no, I'm like I was like, cry. I like, was freaking I, almost crying in there. Oh my God, dude. Do you know what side it potentially gets? Your girl, your hair, sorry. Oh. You've got that. <laughs> Let me see. Okay, that makes me feel so much better. I'm sorry because I was getting a bit scared there for a second. Um, so yeah, it was on the side right next to me pretty much. Like okay. it sounded like it was like right here. Just, it sounded almost like it went But also, oh my God, uh, 
You kept on saying in your Estes session, chair, chair. Jenny, it could have been that. If you're still in that room over there, if you could light up the cat ball on the baby chair, then maybe we could come into that room again. Would you prefer that we came into that room? The, the two different spirits here are pulling us in different directions. Um, did you know that the, 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 the guy who built this house and like the dad who lived here was called John? No. I freaking thought that. That's what I was saying. Like you were saying John and I was going, oh, like John. And then I thought about it. I was like, you, you didn't know his name was John no. though. Like who, the, I, like the I actual don't... dad that lived here. Yeah, yeah. That's so wild. That was amazing. That was seriously, honestly, like one of the coolest Estes sessions. The, the responses were incredible. And they are so prominent here, Mandy. They they are here. I've never heard voices in full sentences so yeah. clear in my life. Yeah. That's why I'm like, like I, I don't want to stop because it's just like it's the craziest thing I've ever heard. Yeah. I've never heard voices like that. Okay, so we're in the dining room and I took off the headphones because I want you guys to hear the responses that I'm hearing. I mean, these are just so clear. Let's ready? do it. I'm so ready. Okay. Maria, are you still here with us? What is that? What? Are you are you talking about I put um the little music box on the chair, the baby chair. Oh. Is that what you're talking about? It's basically it just plays music. It's like a little Listen. Run. It just plays like a little lullaby, listen. But I would really love if whoever was playing with the cat ball earlier, if they could go over to that musical device. The energy in here is different. Like good or bad? I don't know, like in this specific room. Um, let me just stand in there and yeah. see. Yeah, yeah. And then, but like if I mean, we could keep everything up. Dude! And those voices were so like... See? Is this John or Maria? Or one of the children? John! John! Wow, John! John, usually people tell us to get out. But you want us to go upstairs. Why do you want us to go upstairs? Quiet down. John, are we disrupting you? Who, me? John, how do you feel about more investigators coming into your home? Mad? Now, how would you feel if there wasn't enough funds? for your house to remain standing. Can you turn it off for a second? Before I even stepped foot in here, when I was doing the intro, I was saying, I genuinely don't think that John Patterson was a bad guy, mm -mm. Um, but there does seem to be like, I mean, this case with the girl getting pushed downstairs and all this stuff, it's like, it doesn't make any sense. But remember, um, in your notes as well, you did write, this is like my house, yeah, don't yeah, mess yeah. about. Mm -hmm. I don't think that he was a bad guy either. Yeah. I think that in that time period, things were just different. You know, it's just, it all seems very just to the time. Yeah. Did you hear that voice? It just sounded like someone went, yeah. Wow. Oh yeah, I heard that. Oh, that's so cool though, because that that sounded like a straight up voice saying, yeah. And it's like, they're agreeing. That's yeah. good. That's really freaking cool. All right, guys. Can't do anything today. Wildfire? Yeah. This, this house sat on three acres, so maybe there was some sort of fire, wildfire, that would make a lot of sense. Insane? 
I don't know what that means. What the fuck was that? Was that a firework or something? Wildfire? Firework? That sounded like a firework, right? Yeah. <laughs> was it a firework or a firecracker or something like that that maybe started the wildfire? Just go away. Just go away. Well, have you enjoyed our company in your home? Wrong word. Wrong word? Okay, so maybe not like welcome, but like, <laughs> we're fine. I just want to say thank you for, I don't think you let us into your home, but thank you for letting us stay in your home and do this. They were like, if we just crank up the heat in here just a little bit more, they might leave. <laughs> and here's why. I just have one question for you, and then we'll leave you alone and we'll go home. Are you ready? How many? No, just one, just one. <laughs> have you ever seen Shrek? He doesn't know what Shrek is. Let's stay and we'll play the entire movie. <laughs> you want to watch Shrek with us? All right, we won't bother you anymore, okay. John. I'm so sorry. Sorry. Bye. Bye. We have one last thing to do before we leave this house. Picture time? Picture time. Okay, I need to get the camera. I don't have a light. Oh my gosh, we were literally just wrapping up. <laughs> Am Sorry, I we really just that scary? Okay, some of the things that have happened in the past, so you know. The rocking chair upstairs was in the parlor. Some people doing a paranormal tour came in. They put a backpack on it. Mm -hmm. They hear a thud when they're standing in this room and the backpack is halfway across the floor. Blondes. Our favorite. Dude, hair came through. Oh, that did. It said your hair. Yeah. yeah. John likes to touch blondes. Their uncle has been known to th threaten to throw people down the stairs. It's the uncle. It's the uncle. He has some bad vibes lots of times. Girls that challenge the father here, he came through this solid wall of table and looked at him and told him to get out. Wait, what? The two girls? There was two girls here and an apparition? Came through the table? Yeah. What? You said that John came through the table. Yeah. And said, get out. The piano's been known to play by itself. The organ hasn't quite got there yet, mm -hmm. but the piano has. Yeah. So that's some of the things that have gone on in the past. I have a question. Um, was there anything to do with like a fire at any time? A wildfire maybe? or One time there was a fire on to the south of us coming over the hill. Yeah. And it was coming towards the church we have in town that was built in 1886. The church. The church fire. kept on coming through. Yeah, the through. church. And then it said the fire. It was like fire, yeah. the fire, wildfire. The fire was burning towards the church with that breeze behind it. And when it got within a certain distance from the church, mm -hmm. the winds changed and pushed the flames back on itself. Dude, stuff. that is so crazy. Were there deaths on this property? Deaths. John died of natural causes here. Okay. There has been a report that there was a 10-year-old boy that drowned in the reservoir here. Okay. We have no proof of it. Are you guys ready to go home? Yeah. All right, let's head out of here. We'll check those in the car. Bye. Bye-bye. Just the, the ominous bell. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye. I have no idea where we're going because for the GPS on, so we need to pull over. Have you got those? Those photos, they've probably developed by now. That's in Jesse's room. Where's that coming from? Part of me, like, just, just play debug. I don't know, like, 
what the mirror, like, if that would create some sort of... Yeah, we probably should have taken three. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, Polaroid film is expensive. Uh, you get one. Who fucking knows? So pointless. <laughs> um, but interesting, though. Like, that's obviously not but supposed very to show up. Yeah, yeah. But that's, that's pretty cool, though. Wait a minute. Yo, dude, there's a fucking face in the mirror. What? There's a face in the mirror. There, you have to look, look close, right here. Oh, oh, you're right, oh, dude. Right? Hold on, the camera is never gonna be able to zoom into that. I'm gonna have to freaking. There's a fucking face in there yeah, with a it's, bonnet. It's so tiny though. Like, it's so that, tiny. I was looking for like a big face. No, I know, I know. <laughs> That's actually really cool. Wow. Right? Yeah. I'm so glad you see it, dude. Yes. I mean, that's an actual, like, it looks like we're looking at a photo. We are looking at a photo. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I don't know. Is that just a little smudge? It might just be a little camera glare going on. It's another face! <laughs> Stop! Stop. <laughs> Let me look. Nothing too interesting in that one. Stop it. What? Do you remember what was behind us in that hallway? Uh, yeah, it was like a clock. Um, with like little hangers Okay, in it, it was. Yeah. There was something there. Okay, yeah. thank God. <laughs> I was like, what is that? It's a ghost clock. <laughs> I was like, what is that? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, okay. that's the look clock. How, look how cute we look. Well, that is a wrap, guys. Thank you so much for joining us. We hope you liked this episode. Please go ahead and leave a comment. What do you guys think of the Patterson house? Should we go back and get more answers or... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I don't yeah, think yeah, we're yeah. going back. There was way no, too many no, bugs. No. If you're loving the Ghost Club episodes, we upload every second Tuesday, but the Tuesday in between, you can join us for our live stream. So make sure that you check those out as well. All right, I think that's pretty much it. That's it. Have a good one. Bye. Bye.